Degrees. Ah, oh, lovely place. The drone company, Teal, going to be acquired by Red Cat Holdings to produce one big drone company. George Mattis is the CEO of Teal, and he joins me now. George, great to have you on the show with us. Am I right in saying that you are the only drone company approved by the U.S. government, and therefore you're going to be building a lot of drones on this new platform for the Pentagon? Is that what you're up to? For Stuart, it's a great day for America, or at least the American drone industrial base. After operating for six years, being the first to produce this category of drone in America, and now, as you say, one of the only government-approved manufacturers of drones, Teal's being acquired by Red Cat Holdings, a NASDAQ-listed company, to fully realize Teal's potential, rebuild this country's drone industrial base, and become the next great American drone company. So, when you've merged, I mean, it's possible that this merged company will go public. Would that then be a pure play in drones? Absolutely, and we, I believe, will be the first publicly traded drone company in this category. And we think the combination of Teal's technology platform, existing product market fit, and strong roadmap, combined with Red Cat's resources and access to capital, will enable massive value creation. All right. What can your drones do that other drones cannot do? Since we last spoke, Golden Eagle, our flagship drone offering that's fully government approved, has been deployed across the federal government and to many companies in the Fortune 500 for use cases like reconnaissance, public safety, and inspections. And one thing I like to say is that when I started the company, I had a fundamental belief that drones will one day improve how we work and live. And so we've designed our technology to be just like an Android phone where it has an app store and use cases way beyond just calling and texting. And so we're very excited to see what the technology can do and what people use it for. Look, I'm sorry to say, I'm interested in the military side of things because I'm intrigued by the idea of drone swarms, clouds of drones operating almost independently. Is that, I, I've heard about this, is it accurate? Does do fleets of drones exist that can attack as a fleet? I'm glad you bring this up because it's actually one of the large inflection points that drone technology is currently going through. A couple of years ago, it took several people to fly one drone. Today, it takes one person to fly one drone. And moving forward, what Teal is enabling is one person to fly many drones. And like you say, that has amazing use cases for military engagement, for reconnaissance, and more. All right. So, look, uh, do you have plans to go public? And if so, when, when am I going to see it? Uh, we will be public through this merger. Red Cat is a oh, NASDAQ company. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Company. So, when, when is this merger complete? Uh, Red Cat and Teal have signed uh, the definitive agreement for this acquisition, and the closing is imminent. So, as of now, if I buy into Red Cat, I'm buying a pure play in drones. That's accurate? That is absolutely right, Stuart. All right, we'll take it. That's what I was looking for. George Mattis, thank you very much for coming back to us today. Very interesting stuff. We hope to see you again soon. Thank you, George. All right, let's move on. Chicago.